Hi, Natasha Zivas here again, and we're upstairs on ABC7. It is National Puppy Day, and we are celebrating big today. Just take a look at these three little cute nuggets. Who are these? Uh, you're holding Dusty, and I'm holding Daisy, and Julia over here is holding Dakota. They're three sisters. Three sisters. Do they all come in at the same time? Yeah, you know, they actually, Marin Humane brought them from a shelter in Bakersfield um, where there's a lot of overcrowding. They really need some help, and so a lot of times Bay Area shelters will bring in animals from, from other shelters. So they came in with their mom, and they just recently sort of flew the coop uh, with their mom, they're done with nursing, and so they'll be available for adoption soon. Uh, they'll need to be spayed and uh, and have their um, shots and get behavior evaluations, but then they'll be looking for good homes. And how soon may that be? Um, probably within the next three or four weeks. So if people are interested, they can call. They can always say, you know, I'm interested in this puppy and put their name in and fill out an application. Um, but we've got all kinds of animals uh, for adoption looking for homes. And that's really the message, right? I mean, adopt, don't shop. And um, how great is the need? Um, the need is extremely great. I mean, animals come in all the time. Um, in the, across the U.S., there are millions of animals waiting for homes and shelters. Um, and there's all kinds. I mean, whatever people are looking for, we can make we can make a match. We consider ourselves matchmakers. So all different breeds and sizes and temperaments, um, and then all different species. We have um, you know small animals like guinea pigs and rabbits to puppies and kitties, um, chickens. We even had a goat recently. So yeah, there's something for everyone. And of course, I mean, puppies are so lovely and cuddly and wonderful, but adults need a lot of love too, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. You know, yeah. Puppies are a lot of work. And while they're adorable, they are a big commitment. But so we try to encourage people to sometimes, you know, think about some older dogs. Um, a lot of times, you know, their personalities have already emerged. They're already potty trained. It can be a lot easier. And you know, the older dogs, it takes a little while for them to get adopted, uh, a little bit longer than the puppies. Same with cats and kittens. So we encourage people to open their minds to a different type of breed or a different age, um, but as it's National Puppy Day, we can celebrate puppies. <laughs> we can always celebrate puppies. Yeah. Do you think sometimes there's a misperception that older animals may be damaged in some way or you know, have some baggage that people just don't want to deal with? And do you think that that's true? Yeah, I think there is that myth, and I will say it's a myth. Um, animals are incredibly resilient, so even when they have come from tough backgrounds, you know, with some love and patience, they can completely turn around. And the vast majority of the animals we have are just a result of people not spaying and neutering. So it's just more of a result of overpopulation versus cruelty or neglect, though that does happen. But again, we've seen story after story of animals just completely turning around with, again, just a little love and patience. So we encourage people to, you know, give them a chance and not just assume that if they're from a shelter, it means that they weren't wanted. That's not the case at all. And if you want to adopt one of these three girls or any of the other animals that you have at the yeah. shelter, uh, what is the number or the email address or website that people sure, should go to? Sure, they can call us at 415-883-4621 or visit marinhumane.org. Perfect. Lisa and Julia, thank you so much for Marin Humane. Thank you.